I know what happens in the Oval Office, and that's what scares me. I come at this from a very unique perspective. Not just having been a journalist, but also having worked for two different presidents. Hey, folks. Big smile. Pete was with the president all the time. Unlike his predecessor, Mr. Trump does not allow his staff photographer to capture photographs of life and work inside the White House. If you just stacked up the images of the Obama presidency and the Trump presidency, you would see the two stories of America in the starkest possible contrast. The job of the chief official White House photographer is to make authentic photographs. The Photographs break down the idea that these people are somehow different from us. I've got an idea for another picture. <laughs> Did you get that piece? Yeah. The first time that we went to the UN, he and Reggie Love played basketball. At one point, President Obama blocks Reggie's shot. And he goes, Did you get that block? And the history has been written. When Barack Obama was elected, I could see what he meant to the African American community. This five year old kid asked Obama, Is my hair cut just like yours? President Obama bent over and let that kid touch his head and his hand. That image stands for how kids will see themselves differently forever. I thought, Who is this man? How does he deal with crisis? Leadership, character, and empathy. Don't you wish we had that now? When I first met Pete, his politics were not at all evident. Pete changed. He could no longer be this fly on the wall. The future! Pete Souza is getting attention online with replies to President Trump's tweets. I had to speak out. I knew how the job should be done. Pete felt the urgency to show what the office can be. This was a 911. Reagan and Obama respected the dignity of the office. The presidency is a serious job, and I was going to do everything I could to make sure people didn't forget that. Do you have a picture for every single thing that Donald Trump has lied about with Barack Obama? Pretty much. 